Hello everyone, in this video we are just going to discuss about the escape sequences available in C language. Let's get started. The escape sequences in C is a particular command which is used along with other library functions that is especially with printf function for manipulating the data that needs to be printed to the output window. So these are the available escape sequences in C language. You can clearly see this backslash a is useful for providing an alert when the program is executed and this backslash b is useful for providing a backspace that is clearing the last character when you provide this command and this backslash f is useful for providing a form feed and this backslash n is useful for moving the cursor to the new line vertically and this backslash r is useful for moving the cursor horizontally to the beginning of the line that is carriage return and this backslash t escape sequence is useful for adding four horizontal tab spaces horizontally and this backslash v is useful for providing vertical tab spaces and this backslash single quotes is useful for including the single quotes in the printf and this backslash double quotes is useful for including double quotes in your printf and this backslash question mark is useful for including question mark in your printf statement and this backslash backslash is useful for including backslash in your printing statement and this backslash zero is nothing but a null character and we will discuss about this backslash zero in detail when we are discussing about strings in c language and now we will try to explore all these escape sequences starting with backslash b so this is one of our previous program written and the output of this program will be very simple that is the string hello world will be printed on the output window so now in this example of printing the string hello world when i add b right over here after the o in the hello our output will be hello b space world so for adding a meaning for this character or for adding a feature for this character b we can add an escape character to the beginning of this p so the escape character in c is nothing but backslash so when i add this backslash to the beginning of the b this backslash will add a feature to the b and this backslash b acts as a escape sequence of backspace so what happens here is the backslash b is the escape sequence for backspace so the printing happens like hello and this backslash b will be performing a backspace by erasing the o right over here which is the last printed data so the hell will be printed along with space of world so let's execute this program you can see hell world has been printed So in this manner, the escape character that is backslash in C is useful for providing a feature for a character written in printf statement. That is, when you add an escape character to the beginning of the character, that character becomes an escape sequence. That character actually adds a feature for the character written after the escape character. So in this manner, the backslash b that is backspace is useful for providing and erasing the previous character in the printf statement. And let's try to understand the backslash n that is new line. So let's take that I just want to print this hello world 
in two different lines what i can do is i am just copying this and i am providing backslash n at the end and i am going to print again the hello world so the output of this program will be very very simple that is the hello world will be printed and the enter will be provided that is the cursor will be moved to the next vertical line and in the next line the again the hello world will be printed let's just execute this program you can see the program is compiled with zero errors and zero warnings i'm just executing this program you can see the hello world has been printed twice in next next vertical rows so this is how the backslash n works so now let's try to understand the backslash r that is the carriage written escape sequence so now you will be getting a pure idea about the difference between the backslash n and backslash r backslash n is useful for moving the cursor to the next vertical line and this backslash r is useful for moving the cursor to the same horizontal line that is if i provide hello world backslash r of after earth so what happens here is the hello world will be printed and this backslash r that is the carriage written will be moving the cursor again to the same horizontal starting line and again the after earth will be printed so this hello world will be erased and the after earth will be printed in the same place so only the after earth in this whole string will be printed as the output in the output window let's execute this program you can see the after earth has been printed so for testing purpose now when i erase this h available right over here you can clearly see instead of the h this d will be printed because this is not been erased only nine characters are available right over here and as a whole we are having 10 characters in this hello world let's execute this program you can see the d has not been erased in the hello world and you can clearly understand from this output that the backslash r is moving the cursor to the same horizontal line beginning so this is the difference between backslash r and backslash n and now let's try to understand the escape sequence of backslash t which is useful for providing four sequential tabs or blank spaces so i am just providing the backslash t in between these two hello and world so that the hello followed by four blank spaces will be provided and then the world will be printed i am just compiling and running the sketch you can see hello followed by you can see hello followed by four blank spaces and then world is printed so this is how backslash t works and now let's check the printing of single quotes double quotes question mark and backslash in your program so for that example i am just going to print this line as a whole that is double quotes of sm teaches three black slashes single quotes of programming for beginners and followed by three back slashes and in the next line do they so i am just going to print the string as a whole for better understanding all these escape sequence that is rest out escape sequence i am just copying this and i am pasting it right over here so take this as an exercise and print the statement in the output window using the escape sequences available and i will highly suggest you to do this on your own and watch the video only if you are having any doubts or after completing the sequence you can watch this video for any corrections 
and i just want you to understand the escape sequences in c in a better way that is why i am providing this exercise for you so the other condition for doing this exercise is you just want to perform the printing operation by using only one print of statement and now let's discuss about the printing solution for this statement i am just erasing this hello world so for printing the double quotes i just want to provide backslash double quotes and sm and for printing the double quotes again i just want to provide backslash double quotes and space teaches backslash 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 there are three backslashes so i am just going to provide one backslash prior to all the backslashes that is why i am providing six backslashes right over here space for printing the single quotes backslash single quotes and programming for beginners backslash single quotes again and space backslash 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 and here i just want to move to the next vertical line by providing backslash n and i just want to print do space they and space i just want to print the question mark for printing the question mark also you just want to provide the backslash and then question mark so the main beauty of this escape sequences is this will provide a meaning for the code written that is this backslash is nothing but the escape sequence in your program and this backslash will be excluding the meaning for that statement written beyond the backslash that is if you write backslash double quotes it will be taking it as a character and if you write backslash question mark it will be taking the question mark as a character and if you write backslash n it will be taking it as a new line feed etc now when i save and execute this program you can see the output is same sm within double quotes teaches three backslashes within single quotes programming for beginners again three backslashes and moving to the next line there is do they along with the question mark so the output is same as per our requirement and we executed and learned the escape sequences in this video i hope you understood what is an escape sequence in c and how you can use all the escape sequences in c see you in the next video thanks for watching